The man is doing things, but I don't know what Just he's like doing. Just like he's got a machine gun. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, I hate instructions. But over here, there's some stuff. Mysterious things. This piece of marble here was a tabletop. Is a tabletop. <laughs> there is a tabletop. I'll have you know. <laughs> Hello. Um, Hi. Oh. <laughs> I'm talking to you, I'm talking to them. Okay. <laughs> we are here outside the wood barn. Yay! Our spiritual home, the wood barn. Because uh, a couple of videos ago we mentioned we had things to unbox and we only showed you one. We only showed you the um, scaffold. scaffold tower, which we still haven't used because it's bloody well rained every single time we've tried to get on it and pull up those trees but anyway the second thing we have to unbox is do, 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 do. let's have a look this wood splitter um <clears throat> to replace our very broken wood splitter which is over there that died several episodes ago <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah it wasn't cared for very well we will care for its new friend it wasn't lack of care we just used it a lot Yes, and then like drowned it in hydraulic fluid. <laughs> well, it was dead at that point anyway. Um, but this one is new. It is aluminium something or other mode, plus rapide, three times faster, etc., etc. And it's extremely heavy. So I don't know how we're going to yeah. build it, just us, but um, let's get into it. Well, hope you had your Weetabix for breakfast. Mm. Yeah, porridge. Porridge is like, rah. What's that feeble? Hey, porridge. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone loves a dish of porridge. Oh, look. <clears throat> Hi. You're getting rained on. Yep. Right, let's get to it, we poo. <laughs> Unboxing. Woo. Oh, man, I hope it's not in 400 bits. Yeah, me too. Oh, look, it's got one of those big... um safety button things <laughs> that makes it look like a proper oh. piece of kit yeah my hands are <laughs> off um right okay. okay why has it already got bits of tree in it don't know that's comes a tree extra tree <laughs> should you run out of tree <laughs> right um <clears throat> this that. you go climbing yes oh that's oh, horrible yes the set of pieces here are being oh, revealed dear. to me as we speak. Some bolts there. This seems to be the body now, and then there's this, these bits. But the body is extremely heavy. <laughs> very, very heavy. I'd like to not have to lift that, but... Some wheels have become apparent. Excellent. <laughs> I'm not seeing it instructions. No, this is a professional item. You don't get instructions. <laughs> they just assume you know what you're doing. Okay. <laughs> Ah, here's some instructions. Excellent. Oh, there's English in there. Wow, really? <laughs> That's useful. <laughs> so um, we have everything out. There are pieces here. Yes, there are. Pieces here. Uh -huh. Numerous. There. Wheels. Great. And this main body bit. Okay. So now we have to follow the instructions. Okay. Rolling. Rolling. <laughs> yeah, we're rolling now. That's our amazing wheels attached with the cotter pins. Excellent. I think that's going to be the single most easy bit of this yeah. entire job. Stage one complete. Very good. Stage two appears yeah. to be put the wheels on the really unbelievably heavy thing, which is this main body. This, this thing, is that right? Ah, this thing. Goodbye instructions. What's that thing? I don't know. That looks like a thing, isn't it? Well, it looks like a load of shrink-wrapped stuff. <coughs> yeah, but look. Look at the picture. Look. Look. That's the motor, so it's yeah, there. Yeah, exactly. Oh, my God. <laughs> right, OK. Uh, yes. And then you bolt it on using bolts. Yep. Which 
presumably are in a I bag mean, somewhere. This bag. Ah. Oh. This is not going to be good. This is going to suck. Right. Yay! <laughs> Okay, so in other news, I have found some treasure whilst I was up in the roof trying to do something or other of the barn. <laughs> up in the roof of the barn, yeah, yes. <laughs> yeah, so um, let's go and have a look at it. Okay. So here I am in the roof of the barn. Uh, let's go through the door and see what there is in here that I found. Yeah, in here. Total darkness, but over here, there's some stuff, mysterious things. This particular mysterious thing is very interesting because I think this is part of a fireplace and that would be amazing. Because look, you can see it's got some of the similar sort of design features as the, the very front door of the chateau above it. Um, so let's get this out into the open and then we can see what it is. Look, it comes with a free trophy stand. <laughs> Yay. So I feel like that hook is critical because there's a picture of it Mm -hmm. being pointed out right okay so to, to what do you do with it take it out or leave it in leave it in <laughs> <laughs> don't mess with it no <clears throat> uh okay okay so can't you put its friend in as well yeah probably a good idea it's really quite heavy. Oh, that's got a spring on it. Why don't we put some of those logs under it so it can rest on them? Yeah. <laughs> that would be your job, because if I let go, the whole thing is going to fall. Yeah, but I'm busy. Right, I'll just keep holding it then, yeah, shall I? Okay. No. <laughs> no, is it very heavy? It's extremely heavy <laughs> and my back is very painful. Oh, right, sorry. What did you say? <laughs> I don't I want to know. hold logs as well. Just put it under the box. There. Okay. Good. Oh, sorry. Man. You should have said. I thought you were just having a laugh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> having a great time with my uh, unbelievably painful log splitter. Now, yeah. the front leg. Ah, ah, where is the front leg? Now it can go this way or it can go that way. Um, it would like you, pardon? It can go which way or which this way? This way? Or this way? Uh, does it have any distinguishing marks no, on it? it's black. Well then, put it on whichever way you like. No, I expect it needs to go the right way. <laughs> Is there a, a general picture of the entire thing? There. That one can deduce things from? That's no use to anybody. Is there a picture of it, Bill? Oh, there you go, look, it goes out. Outwards. All right. Well, there you go. Uh, so that would be this way. Would it? It would. Oh. So far, we've got no pieces left over. Ooh, but wow, we're only on stage exciting. two, so. <laughs> Which way around does it go? What spring washer then spring thing? Uh, I reckon we can stand it up. Uh, what? What? This looks like it should have something connected to it. Uh, does it not? Something's happening there. Yes, look here. The man is doing things, but I don't know what Just he's like doing. He's got a machine gun. <laughs> he's like, I hate instructions. Well, what's next then? This bit where the man's firing a machine gun into I his got thing. A machine gun. <laughs> well, did it not come with one? No. That's annoying. Right. So what do I do? I don't know. Show me the pieces we have, and we'll try and work out what's meant to happen next. Let's stand it up. Okay. I'm going to go and put the camera down over there for this like <laughs> glorious moment of 
Kane and inaugural have inaugural 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 <laughs> standing up moment where I can't remember how to speak properly. Excellent. <clears throat> Okay, so we've got the pieces down. Um, let's have a look at what we've got here. Helen's sporting a lovely brush that we found up in the roof there. Yes, very good quality. But look at this. So this is for sure a fireplace and it's various three-dimensional parts that have to be reassembled. Um, we're just trying to find out, figure out where everything went. These bits are a bit of a mystery to me at the minute. Um, We've also got this, which we have another one of in the house that's used as a sewing table top. I don't think this is part of the fireplace, but it was up there anyway. So these are the pieces that we've got. The question is, in what order do they go? <laughs> because there's a lot of them and it's mm. three dimensional. So we figured out by just like the size that these are probably edge pieces that would have been this way round and not that way round. I and think these, these are as well. On the front. And those are what, my love? I reckon these are edge pieces, because look, they've got the same little circular imprint. Are they the same length as this? Uh, these guys are the same length. That's, that's interesting. So there we go. That's part of the puzzle yes. as well. Don't know which way round they would have been. Let's brush it. Some more. Oh, okay, with the convenient brush. Convenient brush, yeah. Let's um, see what we've got here. And while Helen's doing that, I just want to show you this again, because this, this pattern here we've got above the front door. So I think this is going to be an original fireplace. And there you go. You can see that it is a sort of similar design. You've got scrolls there, sort of scrolly design resting on the uh, pilasters, as we were told that they were called, left and right here, which is very similar to what we've got on our recovered fireplace, leading me to be zoomed in too much. Yeah, I would say, wow, that's bright. I would say that that's a, it's a fair possibility, probability that this is an original fireplace because the design is the same. Um, let me know what you think. Let us know what you think. Okay. Let's stand it up. Let's. Ugh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it just went drip. right down the back of my neck. <laughs> <laughs> a big drip landed on you. Yep. Grim. Do you want the motor end? I've got the motor end. Or do you want the other end? Okay. Right. Three, two, one. Turn. Oh my goodness. Oh, there she blows. <laughs> Uh, there we go. There we go. Okay. Oh, it's tiny. It's a bit low, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I remember looking at this in the shop and thinking it's for like umpa lumpers. Now, what? There's some something happening now, isn't there? Uh, yep. We're making a video about building the splitter. <laughs> Look, there's a flap of some kind here that we don't appear to have. Uh, it's part number seventeen. Mm. Right, there's a handle now, uh, which isn't there, so we have to put the handle on. Ooh, and I think that's down here there. somewhere. Right, here's your knob. Hey. Let's attach it. <laughs> okay, do you know where it goes? goes? Yeah, I'm guessing it goes there. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> it might go there, but I'm going to put it here. <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 where's the pictures? I don't know. Look, there we go. Knob attached. That's what it does. I know, but... For sure. Here's the pictures. Okay, let me see the pictures. Confirm knob attachment functionality. Mm. Yeah, I guess. Where was the other place where it could have gone? There. I don't know what that is. There's a mysterious thing in there. I don't know whether that's this or... I'm going to put that in there. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> No? I can't work out which one goes where. Well, I'm pretty sure that goes there because there it is in place. <laughs> Wait. And then look. This no, goes No, stop. No, no, you're going too fast. <laughs> no, it's okay. Because <laughs> look, that goes like that. And then this stops it from happening. 
Ta da! Who needs instructions? Oh, now, then, what is this thing? Wait! <laughs> Stop! Stop! <clears throat> Now then, which bit comes first? Because there's a, like an infinite number of these stupid things. Now you need the arch this. thing, that this thing. thing. Yep. And look, this starts to build like that. Ah, okay. Yeah, like this, viewers. See? He has to do that. And then it looks like that at the end. Wow, it's in place. It's in place, yeah. It's getting done up. This is so far successful. I think probably because it came partially built in the box. Yeah. <laughs> if we'd have been doing this with 420 different bits of metal, things may well have been significantly different. Right, that's on. Now what, now what? Now those black bits go into some combination of black bits and they sit on the end of it. Come and see my uh, laid out fireplace, okay. as I think it was in the back in the day. Okay, show me. It's behind me. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> <laughs> so it is. <clears throat> uh, well. There you go, yeah. Can you see the bit that I've pit pillaged? <laughs> yes, yes. I noticed that my tabletop had gone <laughs> from in the I hallway. Think, so yeah, I think that is a bit of the mantelpiece for uh, maybe not this fireplace, but definitely another fireplace. I've tried to put it where I thought it should have gone. Okay. What do you think? Yes, it's a fireplace. I mean, we, I did look online in order to figure out how to do this, and there is a very, very similar one that we found on eBay. It's not quite the same, mm, but yes. it's very similar. We'll put pictures up of that so you can see what this probably did, did look like in the end. Yeah. But I'm going to go and sh let's have a look. I'll show you now in close up. So here you go. This is it laid out as I think it was um, originally. You can see that the, this piece of marble here was a tabletop. Is oh. a tabletop. <laughs> <laughs> there is a tabletop. I'll have you know. <laughs> So that gives you um, just some idea of what it, the colour of it after it would have been cleaned up looks like. Um, and so we think this is how it was. And so these bits were giving me a lot of trouble. I'll have to get around this side. Um, oh, the little square bits yeah, and stuff. Yeah, but I think they're part of the 3D nature of it. And because you can see here, this bit has been you can just see where the old mortar is at an angle here. So I think this would have been below, below here. And because if you line up this to that, there's a little gap here and there's no, there's no gap between here and here. And this piece is exactly that width. So I think that this <coughs> would have gone here. Um, obviously this would be set down into this scene and all of this would have been on a, laid out in 3D rather than in 2D. And again, you can see here on this side, there is some um, mortar there where it was covered. So, and handily, look at this, the angle is exactly right for that to have been like that. So I think that's how it was. <laughs> so yeah, really pleased with that. I found that up in the, in the barn. Um, we're going to go and put it somewhere safe now mm. so that it's a bit more protected than it would have been just up in the barn. Yeah. Um, but that's another piece of the history of Kuzanak revealed, so that's really good. It is built. We finally built it. We've got power to it. We've managed to open this incredibly difficult to open weird flappy thing here that you're not <laughs> filming currently. This took some amount of thinking to undo. Yeah. There's green. Yeah. We've got logs. I've got safety glasses. And you've got your coat on finally. And my coat. I can't see through these safety glasses though. Excellent. Right. Probably want to move my gloves off the top of it. Uh, 
So we split logs. That's what you do with a log splitter. Okay. It's too, it's too big. <laughs> Great. That's Yay, too big. That's that log. Oh. <laughs> right. That's a log in. What will happen? Mummy. That doesn't sound right. That does not sound right. Jesus Christ. Okay. <laughs> Off we go. <laughs> Let's read the instructions, shall we? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, you're doing it right. It says that's how it should be. That ain't right. Move the safety lever, the one that's behind the shield, and then move the other lever. That did not look sound right at all. It did not. Take two. But this, to me, shouldn't really be doing Take that. Take the log out and see if you can run it. No. Something's very wrong here. Right, Helen's going to have a go. Um, I think there's something wrong with this, but we shall see if Helen can figure out how to do it. She's so, consulted the instruction manual. This moves to allow that to move, yeah, right? Yeah, that's right. And look, it goes all the way back now. It didn't do that before. No. Does that stay in place or do I have to hold it? Let's find out. Okay. <laughs> Ooh. See what I mean? Yeah. Once the motor's running, it's unhappy. Yeah. But that's very annoying. It yes, does it is very annoying. Come all the way back. Because we spent hours building this damn thing and it doesn't work. We spent hundreds paying for this damn yeah, thing. Yeah, it's well. like 300 odd bucks. It just no, doesn't no, 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 it was 500. 500? Mm hmm. Oh my God. Don't know. I don't know. Because there was nothing to do. This was all partially built. Yeah. That's a bit worrying, isn't it? Partially built, but back at the shop. Hmm. <laughs> from someone that like yeah. put it together and it didn't work and they returned it yeah there is that isn't oh, there god and we had a return hmm well this is a disappointing end extremely such an anti-climax we spent ages yep. building this stupid thing and it doesn't bloody work <laughs> Oh, oh God, yes. I don't know how we're going to get the manufacturer's advice on this, maybe by email, which they never read. Uh, take you back to the shop. I am not putting this back together again. And we just threw away all the packaging. No, we didn't. It's just over there. Yeah, but it's all completely soaked. Oh, man. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed us putting it together. Hopefully Yay. we can get it working. <laughs> yep. Uh, like, subscribe, share us around. <laughs> And we'll see you on the next one. <laughs> it was successful. We did build it. We thing. built it. Yeah. <laughs> There's always got to be something, though. Oh, <laughs> Stay tuned goodness. and we'll tell you at some point whether it's fully dead or not. Bye. Bye.